How are you doing guys? In this course, we will look at introducing icons. For instance, uh, if you look at the Udemy, you see that there's an icon here and all these guys have icons. Look at all these icons. See? Look at this guy, it's an icon. Look at this guy, it's an icon tool. So, um, we'll, we'll be looking at icons. Look at icons. Look at an icon, look at an icon, an icon. So, if you look through any beautiful website, you'll see um, lots of icons. Icons are a good way look at icons here they're a good way to tell people what is contained in the text or whatever that button is look at icons look at an icon all right so let's see how to add icons in bootstrap if we go to bootstrap we can look for icons i am looking for where it is um colors borders components badge so generally so um i think it's in extend so you click on extend extend opens and you see icons you see click on icons so bootstrap allows you bootstrap allows you um, to import icons from any of these links the most popular one and the one i recommend is font awesome so you click on font awesome it takes us to font awesome website so um in case you don't know you want to visit the url directly it is called font awesome a w e s o m e dot com font awesome dot com it opens this this site just has a, a lot of icons thousands of icons so what we're gonna do is to import it i'll click on get started so when you click on uh, get started we're dealing with the web fonts because we're designing a website so if you copy this and paste at the top of your website all of a sudden font or sound will start working on your platform so let's copy this copy then we take to our website the top the head head section look at the head section um yeah just paste then we have save ctrl s on your keyboard then we're good then the next thing we have to do is um where are we yep so we can now go and start looking for the fonts we want. Remember the font we want to get is this one that looks like a shopping cart. So we are on font awesome. We can now start searching for icons. Click on icons. Make sure you have your internet connectivity, otherwise it won't work. So the icons have opened. We can now start searching for shop. So you basically type any name that feels like what you're looking for then you start seeing icons like that let's compare the icons we're seeing here to what we have here so this is look at this it's transparent inside pay attention to the design uh the one we're seeing here is not transparent inside it's opaque we're looking for the transparent one look at uh, this one is transparent this one is transparent see makes sense pro pro so it's like they're selling the ones that are not transparent so we have to manage the transparent one that is free so you click on it if you want to pay to get the pro version you can pay so this is it and uh, this is the code at the bottom here they will show you the code to paste and that will appear so i've copied the code if you click on this it will copy to see i've copied the code then i can go paste it in my code if i come here at a, in our code if we scroll down we will see this place that we typed you this, this is the place so we'll delete the u and replace it with what we have you see this is what we're replacing it with so if we go and refresh keep your eye here as i refresh that's it so we would have used the one that is transparent if not that it is for sale all right so another thing we can do is we can do a font for the search so we will go and look for search we'll go back then we look for search search all right i think this makes sense let's go back and check what we're looking for yes makes sense this is we click on it and it will give you the html down here we have the html fast search 
control copy then we're good then we'll look for a search button instead of typing search we'll do this and uh, this is green instead of red um on in line according to what we had in the buttons danger gives us red instead of success outline we'll say danger danger gives us red then um in this cut i want to give it another space of mx mx2 i want it to space out the reason i want it to space out is that i don't want it to touch so i'll do everything should space out let's see what it looks like refresh yeah things are quite spaced out now looks cool and looks cool i know we don't have this perfectly sorted out yet but don't worry um, we'll take care of everything in the next video thank you very much see you guys in the next video